Hi everyone. Newton's third law of motion, for every action there's an equal and opposite reaction, might be applied to the beginning of the universe with the Big Bang. We all know the Big Bang Theory, not the TV show, the real theory, where in the universe was created in an infinitesimal second with an explosion from something so small to something so huge, blowing out. Now what if, by law of Newton, the reaction of blowing out, we have an equal force blowing in, thus creating an infinitely small universe of infinite space, another dimension. We think of dark matter as we know it's there because of the gravitational effects. We, we can't see it, we can't touch it, but we know by its mass it's there. The, the, the dark matter could exist in this other dimension at the same time as in our dimension. So kind of like this Kool-Aid and this geode. You take the, uh, the geode goes in the Kool-Aid. Remember F1, force one, force two. So for every action, there's an opposite and equal reaction. Blowing out, blowing in. Now I can't do the math on that, but I know a lot of you physicists are a lot smarter than me might want to look at it. That might help explain what dark matter is in both dimensions. We have a dimension that we live in and can see, touch, three dimensions in our world. We can see, touch, feel and the ones we can't, but it's there all the same. Thanks.